Hey everyone. In this short video, I'll guide you through understanding the Facebook news feed and show you how to manage it effectively by choosing what you want to see and what you'd rather avoid. Just watch this video till the end and do not forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel for more tutorials and tips video. The Facebook news feed, now sometimes called simply feed, is the central hub of activity on Facebook. It appears on the central area of a user's Facebook homepage or mobile app. It is designed to provide users with a personalized and constantly updating display of posts, photos, videos, and other content shared by friends, pages you follow, and groups you are a part of. The purpose of the news feed is to keep you informed about what's happening in the lives of your friends and family, expose you to new and interesting content, and connect you with relevant communities and businesses. But sometimes you may get unwanted posts and videos on your news feed. Don't worry you can customize your news feed to see more of what you like and less of what you don't. Facebook news feed settings offer various ways to customize what you see, ensuring you get a personalized and engaging experience. Step 1. Adjust your Facebook news feed preferences. Your feed preferences help you control what you see on your feed. After opening the Facebook app, click on three horizontal lines from the top right corner of the screen. Now, scroll down and tap on Setting and Privacy. After that, tap on Settings. Here you will see various Facebook settings. Under Preferences, tap on News Feed to customize your news feed. From here you can manage, favorites, snooze, unfollow, reconnect, and reduce. Favorites. From here you can select people and pages you want to see higher in your feed. Their latest posts will appear closer to the top, so you don't miss them. You can add a new people, page, or group to your favorites list or remove your previously added to favorites. And you can also unfollow them. Unfollow. From here you can unfollow a person, page, or group. This allows you to completely hide posts from people or pages you no longer want to see in your feed. Reconnect. If you previously unfollowed someone, you can easily reconnect and start seeing their posts again from here. Reconnect to follow a person, page, or group that you unfollowed in the past. Reduce. From here you can reduce low-quality content, unoriginal content, and sensitive content. Just go through them one by one and reduce what type of content you don't want to see on your news feed so that you are less likely to see it. Step 2. Select Show More or Show Less. You can customize your Facebook feed by selecting Show More or Show Less on a post from the Facebook app on your mobile device. For this, from the Facebook app on your mobile device, go to the post you want to see more or less of. Tap on the three dots in the top right of the post. Now, tap Show More to see more posts like the one you selected or tap Show Less to see fewer posts like it. Selecting Show More will temporarily increase the ranking score for that post and posts like it, which is one of the factors we use to personalize what you see in your feed. If you select Show Less, you'll temporarily decrease its ranking score. Step 3. Snoozing a profile, page, or group on Facebook. Snoozing a profile, page or group prevents you from seeing their posts in your feed for 30 days. The profile, page, or group you've snoozed won't know that they've been snoozed. You can only snooze someone from a post in your feed. To snooze a profile, page, or group from your feed. First, click three dots in the top right of the post in your feed. Now, click snooze for 30 days. You can also hide posts, unfollow, or block someone from your news feed. Overall, the Facebook news feed is a powerful tool for staying connected and informed, but it's important to take advantage of the customization options to create an experience that works best for you. Facebook offers various ways to personalize your news feed. By actively managing settings and exploring available options, you can reduce the noise and curate an experience that suits your preferences. Hope this video helped you. If so, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more tutorials and tips videos. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment box.